A subtle yet very important change to Media Composer 5.0 is the addition of the linked selection tool as well as the smart tool editing palette. Historically in Media Composer, to make adjustments to a segment or a transition, you would have to enter a specific mode. Now with the smart tool, depending on where your cursor is placed in the timeline, these operations are engaged automatically. Let's look at the link selection button first. With link selection engaged, when I click on a video or audio clip, the related clips or segments are selected automatically. Without link selection, it's the old method of working in Media Composer where clicking on a video clip selects only that video segment. The smart tool itself is made up of five different operations. Segment mode for lifting and overwriting, segment mode for extracting and splicing, overwrite trim, ripple trim, as well as audio keyframe adjustments. Any combination of these modes can be selected at any one time, or you could choose to have them all on at once. As I move my cursor over the timeline, you'll notice the different modes change based on the position of the cursor itself. When I'm near the top of a clip, clicking the mouse engages segment overwrite. When I'm near the bottom portion of a clip, you can see that it puts me in insert mode. As we hover over transition, now we're in trim mode. Positioning the cursor over an audio keyframe allows you to adjust that keyframe directly. If you choose, you can have the Smart Tool disengaged so that Media Composer operates as it always has. You can even map the Smart Tool to a key on your keyboard to make engaging and disengaging this feature much easier.